I started day one, I didn't have a measurement tape, but we got one. Now we can take measurements of everything. Those are the measurements. Yo, my legs are huge, yo. I mean, that's where that's where I hold the majority of my weight. But yeah, that's it, man. Those are the results. Yeah. Guys, I'm gonna be honest, I did not get enough sleep last night. And on my days off, I typically catch up on my sleep. But last night, mm -mm. don't even ask how much sleep I got. I don't, I don't even, even want to show it. So yeah, we got the water, 32 ounce, first 32 ounce today. I've been trying the salt, bro, bro. The salt is disgusting. I got potassium, got a little bit of Himalayan salt in here. This is disgusting. Like this is horrible. I could barely drink it. Well, I'm gonna chug it because I'm a man. Oh, oh, that's horrible. Oh, I need something else. Instead of getting a hot coffee, I got a black iced coffee. It's so loud. Look at that buzz going by. This one was $5.12 for this coffee. I'm so confused because yesterday, I think I spent $4 on black coffee, like a hot coffee. This one's $5.12. That's insane to me. I, I... I haven't walked down the street in a minute, but that house that we just passed, that one right there, they were working on it a couple weeks ago. And it looks really nice. Man, I'm telling you, listen, listen to this bird. That bird is wow. Yeah, I would have never gotten up and just walk outside. Doing the 10,000 step challenge really help me maintain this energy and this wantingness of going outside and walking every day. Well, yeah, yes it is. You know it's hot. The skinny guys like that run with their shirt off. So you know I'm dying right now. I'm trying to get like them. It's hot. Again, we are stuck in the house because of this freaking weather today. Oh my goodness. The past three days, the weather has been terrible. So today, when I was walking to get my coffee, right? When I got home, I, was, I felt really shaky. I wasn't hungry at all. I just, for some reason, I don't know if my blood sugar was low and I forgot to check my blood sugar. I don't know if it was because it was too hot or what, but it, it was not good. I felt like I could have really passed out. Since I'm documenting the journey, I just wanted to note that I felt kind of shaky. Today, I honestly, I did not have that much food again. I, oh man, it, this, is, this is terrible. It, it's so hard to get food, man. I went to the mall and basically just walked around. I thought it was a little bit better and safer since it was a tornado warning. I went to uh, Dick's Clearance and to see if they had any shoes they did but the shoes didn't really look too good i didn't like it at all uh i was about to drop some money but decided not to do that i went to go get my hair cut but here's the thing i I'm, I'm on like an 18 hour fast at this point because i didn't want to eat something then have to go poop while getting my hair cut that would have been the worst thing ever like who gets up to go poop when you're sitting in a barber's chair like that's so rude right like he's not gonna wait 20 minutes for me i gotta wait 20 or 30 minutes for him yeah i didn't eat which was fine i wasn't hungry at the time anyway story time i need my hair done I go to my barber. They got a nice couch in there. You can sit down. It's all nice. It's wide. There's no big boy problems right there. They got a couch you can sit on, right? I sat down. I waited for my barber. He was like, yo, I'll be in in like five. I'm like, cool. I'm waiting. He gets there. He's like, yo, what's up, boy? What's up, homie? What's up, G? I love you. I love you too, man. So he's sitting there. He's like, yo, chair's ready. So I get up, not thinking about it. I go over. Like the main barber in the barbershop in the mall, it, he has like 
metal, like a seriously gold plated metal seat. And then like my barber, he just has like one of the standard seats and it's red and it's cheap. I'm not gonna lie, it's cheap. I'm just saying. I go and sit down and, and like he like adjusts it and the thing just drops. It drops to the ground. And he was like, yo, it's all right, man. Like, I, I, I'll boost you back up. So he's boosting me up. And ain't boosting up. And I'm just like, oh, my goodness. And it was like three people in there. It was like a mom her, with her child and her husband. And this guy's like, like he, he, he's a man, man. He's just looking at me. And I'm looking at him. And I'm looking at my barber. I'm like, yo, barber, you good? He was like, yeah, I'm good. While he's like, yeah, come on, come on, come on. I'm like, bro, I'm just going to get up. He's like, nah, I got it. I'm like, no, bro, I'm going to get up. So I got up and he raised it up. And I was like so scared to sit back down again. And I just like all eyes on me. I sit back down. Thankfully, it didn't break again. So yeah, oh man. But even though I know people don't really care, it's still in the back of my mind like, dang, if I was just like, 150 pounds this wouldn't have happened okay we got home and we finally sat down to eat right and i had a tortellini salad it had a bunch of meat in it like turkey chicken just a whole bunch of stuff i told my wife to just dump it all in there try to get as much protein in there and that that whole bowl was around like 3,000 calories i ate about half that and i didn't follow my rule about not stuffing my face and taking something smaller and then 20 minutes wait because I was starving at that point when I got home. I just wanted to eat something because I knew I needed to eat something. And that's it. That's all I had. I had around like 1500 calories probably, maybe less, but still I feel like I need to be eating more. And I feel as though that's a lot of protein for me to be taken in, in one sitting because I only had time to eat one, one meal. <sighs> it was rough. We hit our goals again. Let's go, baby. Yo, we hit 10,000 steps again. We tracked our calories and we fasted for 16 hours. Matter of fact, we fasted for 17 hours. I'm just saying, I'm calling that a win. You calling it a win? Because I'm calling it a win. 